Okay. Supermarket girl? She was a hobby. Orange? Yeah. I'm still trying to find the red Savina. Sweet banana, poblano, jalapeno, serrano, orange hobby, and red Savina. I guess the question is, is there another level after the unattainable red Savina? Mace. <laughs> okay, tell me about the hobby. Uh, wifey jumped in, but I had her. Okay, which approach? The expose my game approach. Mm -hmm. Strong play. Blonde. Flaxen and exotic. Mm. And today? Typical stuff. Good guy, niece thing. Just pop in. You know the drill. Does wifey know you're gaming again? I don't think so. <laughs> She's gonna want back in. It's too much fun. Yeah, I know. I'll, I'll see you soon. Excuse me. Excuse me for not being an expert here, but what does an uncle buy his niece for her birthday? You seem to have fashion acumen. Would you help me? How old is she? Thirteen, and as mean-spirited as they come. Well, if she's thirteen, she definitely has to be stylish, right? Right. We can't dress her like a dork. Right. Listen, I appreciate you helping me here. I'm Alex. It's nice to meet you. Farah, no sweat. I've already spent way too much money. See that rack over there? That's all my stuff. Are you serious? Whoa! Somebody had to stop you. Do you realize how much money I'm saving you just simply by showing up here today? <laughs> you owe me big time. This is all women have in life. Shopping, that's it. Men have so many more emotional outlets, you know? Interesting thought. Funny, huh? I think women should have their own kind of place. A place where they can go and relieve their own kind of stress. A place where they can go after a miserably long day of work and relax and be treated the way a lady should be treated. Upon arrival, they can be handed a rose by a meticulously dressed gentleman. They can be pampered all night, no strings attached, of course. Throw in a pedicure, a few glasses of wine, vent for about an hour, probably to that same meticulously dressed gentleman, and call it a night. Hey, this one is nice. Kind of trendy, but not trashy, right? You have a very interesting mind. Where do you buy your thoughts? <laughs> they just kind of pop in my head. And quite a perfectly chiseled head, I might add. <laughs> You're very nice. Thank you for taking some time out for me. It's no problem at all. You seem like a sweet guy. Mr. Simmons? Cherie, what's up? Uh, what's up is you should never beat a friend, six love. Six love! You know I'm overly competitive. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. Um, Cherie, this is Farah. She was nice enough to help me pick out some clothes for Anna. I feel like we just celebrated her birthday. Well, if you want, you can help us. Oh, I have to go, but thanks. Okay, well, um, maybe I'll fire up the grill this weekend? Mm, as long as you have some Primitivo, I'm there. <laughs> Bye, y'all. Nice to meet you, Farah. It's nice to meet you as well. I think we have a winner. Oh, that works for me. Primitivo, huh? 2003, great vintage. I gotta tell you, my friend called this morning and she told me that she had an 84 Pomerol ready to taste today. I'm at it over there now. It's a block up the app.
Thank <laughs> you.